what's up guys? It's Kerry Sullivan with RockstarTriathlete.com coming at you guys today with some triathlon tips for the women out there doing the all women's races as those are starting to take on more popularity, which is a great thing. So the first piece of advice I'm going to give to all the women out there is when you're swimming and you're looking for the buoys to go for, look for the buoys that you're actually going to turn around. So the first buoy you go for make a straight line for the one that you know you have to make a turnaround. A lot of the time they'll put little buoys or markers in the water leading up to that buoy. And a lot of the time those can get zigzagged or knocked off place and most people will just follow those little buoys all the way along. So what you can do is you can avoid the big mosh pit of people swimming to each of those little buoys to the one buoy that's really important for them to turn around. So just aim for that main big buoy so you can be super efficient and avoid a lot of the mosh pit. Two, the second tip I'm going to give you guys is actually taking your shoes off on the bike. It'll help you save a lot of the time come transition. So what you can do is you're cycling along and when you're getting close to getting off, put your leg up into the uh, 12 o'clock position on the bike pedals. So it's basically up as high as it can go. You're going to reach down, you're going to unstrap your shoe and then you're going to slip your foot out of your shoe. You can grab the back of your shoe. Usually if you're in tri triathlon pair of cycling shoes, you, there's a little hook or loop that you can grab and you can just slip your foot out and then you're going to place your foot on top of the shoe, your bare foot, and then you're going to take a few more cranks just to get a little momentum going and then you're going to do the exact same thing on the opposite foot and that will help save you a lot of time in transition. You'll be able to run through it faster and uh, you won't have to take off your shoes once you're in transition because you've already done it. So those are two tips I got for all the women out there doing their all women's triathlons. And other than that, rock on and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye bye.